Right, I'm going to show you how to find the gradient of a line that passes through two points. Gradient just means steepness, how steep something is. Here's a picture of what we're talking about. Here's our line. It passes through the two coordinates we just had in the question, 5, 7 and 3, 1. And we're going to see how steep this line is or find its gradient as it said in the question by looking at the distance it moves up from here to there which is 6 divided by the distance moved across from here to there which is 2. How do we get 6? Very easy. This dot is 7 high because it's the y part of the coordinate says it's 7 high and this dot is 1 high, you can read that from the coordinate. So from 1 to 7, you've simply moved up 6. And we're told we're 3 across here and 5 across there. This dot is 5 across, this dot is 3 across, as you can see here. So from 3 to 5, you've moved 2. The calculation, if the numbers were really big, um, would be the distance moved up is 7 take away 1, and the distance moved across is 5 take away 3. And anyway, so the gradient is 6 divided by 2, which is 3. Here's a summary. So even if you didn't have the picture, you could do it. Um, if Drawing the picture is not very difficult because the picture is done very roughly, not accurately. You can do the same, do a rough picture. But here's a summary. The gradient is the differences between the x, so the y bits, which I've coloured in, in green, divided by the differences in the x bits, which gives you 6 divided by 2, which is 3. Um, you could even do it the other way around. You might think it might give you the wrong answer, but minus 6 divided by minus 2 still gives you 3. So let's do a quick summary. The question says find the gradient of the line. So basically find the steepness of the line. Here's a picture of what we're talking about. To find the steepness or the gradient you do the distance moved up divided by the distance moved across between these two points. Um, you find the distance moved up by taking away from each other the y parts of the coordinates which I've colored in green divided by the taking away the different or finding the differences between the x parts of the coordinates, so that's 5 take away 3, which is 2. So, I've coloured that in green, coloured that in purple or pink, whatever that is, um, and you can see that here, green divided by purple, y's divided by x's, difference between the y parts of the coordinate divided by the uh, the differences in the x part of the coordinates. So 6 divided by 2, which is 3. That's it.